Hey everyone, I'm Nico here and in this video I'm going to show you how to navigate a browser by using Piato GUI. By using Piato GUI, we can move the mouse and we can uh, type in some text into the computer by using the Python code. So, if you now install this Piato GUI, then go to CMD and type pip install Piato GUI and hit enter. I already installed it, it is going to say that it is satisfied so now I'm not going to do that I'm just closing this one and now let's get into this code as you can see this is the code and you need to only install this Piata GUI and other two are just installed so we need to import all these three things first one is web browser and afterwards we need to import this Piata GUI and I'm just using the alias name for this one that is PY instead of typing all this Piata GUI you can just enter py and we can do whatever we want with that one afterwards we are just importing this time module also then here we have a first line this line is going to say that we are going to open google.com in a default web browser and afterwards we are just uh, stopping the code for three seconds because opening a web browser is not going to be happen in a second so just we are making sure that google has been opened and we are waiting for three seconds like that and afterwards we are typing nickel tag into this one you can type any text but i am just typing this nickel tag and afterwards here we are saying that we need to enter the return key that means enter key on our keyboard and then we are going to say that we should move our mouse to a 0, 0,500 position so it is going to be like this position as you can see my pointer then we are again making the code to sleep for one second and afterwards we are saying that pi dot click that means left click on our mouse button and afterwards we are hitting the tab button by using our code and again enter so this is the code as you can see i included enough comments to understand if you want to copy this code or you want to do something modifications to this code you can go to this url i'll keep this link in the description you can go to a browser and paste that over here and you can say like ctrl a and ctrl c and you can copy and you can do whatever you want with it so now let's just run this code i'm clicking this run button over here and as you can see now our website has been opened so you can do this trick with any other website so that's it guys i'll talk to you in my next video subscribe if you like to watch more videos like this if you like this video click the like button and thanks for watching guys have a nice day